What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another draw preview and we have a brand new ATP 250 event this week The Serbia Open and you can probably guess who's going to be playing this one But let's go to the players who are pulled out of this event. So some big names are pulled out of this event We have Borna Choric. He's out. Monfils is out. Nishioka is also out. Dominic Team is pulled out with injury Vadasco, Vesely and Stan Vavrinka is still recovering from surgery Okay, so let's start at the top of the draw now and the top four seeds get a buy in the first round Number one seed is the number one player Novak Djokovic he, of course, would be playing in the Serbia Open. Gets a buy in the first round. He'll take on the winner of Quan or a qualifier in the second round. Then we have Jera versus Londero. Winner of that's going to play either another qualifier or the number eight seed, Kecmanovic. So a lot of Serbians in that top part of the draw. Then we have the number three seed, Karatsev. He gets a buy in the first round. He'll take on the winner of Korda or Bedene in the second round. And remember, Korda at the Miami Open destroyed Karatsev. So keep an eye on that matchup if it happens. Then we have a qualifier versus Poprin. Winner of that's going to take on either another qualifier qualifier or the number six seed Fucevic in the second round. So of course you've got to be watching out for the two big seeds in this one, Djokovic and Karatsev. But keep an eye out on the sixth seed as well, Fucevic, very underrated player and doesn't mind playing on clay as well. So watch out for him as well. He might be able to get out of this part of the draw maybe make the semi-finals. All right, bottom half of the draw now. We've got the number seven seed, Milman. He'll take on the wild card, Petrovic, in the first round. Winner of that's going to take on either Quavos or Rusaveri in the second round. Good first round matchup there. Then we have Barenkis versus Delbonis. Winner of that's going to take on number four seed, Lajovic, in the second round, who has a bye in the first round, of course. Then we have the number five seed, Krajinovic. He takes on Travalia in the first round. Winner of that's going to play either Milojevic or Korea in the second round. Then we have another wild card from Serbia, Troitsky. He takes on Chekinado in the first round. Circle, that is a fun match in the first round to watch. Winner of that's going to take on number two seed, Berrettini, who gets a buy in the first round. So, of course, you've got to watch out for Berrettini and, of course, Lajevic as well, the two top seeds. But also keep an eye on the number five seed, Krajanovic, and also the wildcard, Troitsky, because the Serbians playing in Serbia, they're obviously going to get a lot of support and they're going to fire up to play well. So watch out for all the Serbs, especially Lajevic, Krajanovic, and Troitsky in this bottom half. So there it is, the Serbia Open. There's some big names, of course, Novak Djokovic, being the biggest of them all. Let me know down in the comments below. Who do you have winning this event? Because there are some big names in this one, but we still don't know what the clay court season is going to look like because we've just started it. All right, going through the list here of who could win this tournament and I've got to give it to the world number one. Being in Serbia, I've got to give it to Djokovic. I think he's going to win this tournament. It's absolutely set up for him and he has a good draw with the biggest seeds around him being Berrettini, Karatev, Lajevic. I think Djokovic can beat them all on clay, and especially in Serbia. So I'm going with Djokovic to win. Again, let me know down in the comments below what do you think is going to happen in this one. So the Serbia Open, an ATP 250 event, 